Well, just a jam filled final weekend of July. There's no better way to describe tonight's festivities along Cincinnati's riverfront. WLWT News 5's Todd Dykes is live at Paul Brown Stadium where tens of thousands of music fans are enjoying music fest. Todd. Yeah, Molly and Curtis, you know, the party still going strong tonight inside the home of the Bengals behind me, but I can tell you it started hours ago at the Cincy Soul Food Festival at Fountain Square. From chicken wings to roasted corn to cupcakes, today's Soul Food Fest at Fountain Square was a feast for food lovers and music fans. We came yesterday. We enjoyed the whole weekend. Great groups, great food, great music, great city. We love it. Sometimes it takes outsiders to appreciate just how festive summertime in Cincinnati can be. The food is good. The music is good. People are friendly. I have a really nice time when I come here. Carolyn Hudgens and Eddie Thomas drove from Chicago to celebrate her birthday and to see R&B legends live. Well, Charlie Wilson is the highlight last night. <laughs> Tonight, I'm not sure. That's still up in the air. We don't know yet. You did, you it's going to be keep sweat for me. Keep sweat. <laughs> <laughs> it's her birthday, so we'll make it keep sweat. We're just having a good time. LaRue Harrington isn't bashful when it comes to showing off his moves, and he's happy to know visitors from other cities are seeing his hometown in such a positive light. Something for everybody doing Cincinnati, you know. Good time is, is no violence. It's, it's just about having a good time. It's like you can bring your family down and bring your kids, you know. So it's just all about having a good time. For Lashana Sutton, selling cupcakes to people having a good time means money and name recognition for Sugar, a small business in Hamilton. Well, it's been really, really busy. Busy, but not too busy to reflect on what Cincinnati's Music Fest weekend represents. It's a great opportunity for the actual community to see us being positive with all the different things going on. And of course, a few blocks away from Paul Brown Stadium, uh, the good times continue. The Reds game tonight ending on a bright note for Reds fans. And then the Cincinnati based rock band Walk the Moon took the stage at a great American ballpark. And I can tell you with so much music happening, you know, happen, music happening at once, it's going to be hard for this city to stand still when the grooves finally come to an end later tonight. Reporting live downtown, Todd Dykes, WWT News 5.